it was heart-wrenching for me to go in there and see how Price Barracks has deteriorated. Um, myself and Minister Marin, being former PDF officers, um, decided that we needed to, to do something. And we are starting from the ground up. We're starting by improving the ablutions of the soldiers first. Um, we will go next with the accommodations and we um, visited the, the kitchen and other facilities at Price Barracks and noticed that a lot of work needs to be done. So yes, we, we did not make any big fanfare, but indeed we went and we started working in the renovations of one of the soldiers' ablutions. Um, we are happy to say that that was finished. And um, last week, we handed over to the general um, very much needed re um, restoration of the ablution block. It has been redone completely. We have also added a solar water heater so that you know the soldiers' comfort is, is what we're looking at. Um, if we can get the soldiers to be comfortable, if we can get the soldiers to, to welfare, to be on the forefront, I think that um, it will make their jobs a little bit easier. We have also started renovating another ablution. And when we are finished with the, uh, with the soldiers' ablution, then um, we will start doing some work for the officers as well. But as Minister Marin uh, mentioned last week, it is about the welfare. It's about welfare of the people who actually do the work out there. Patrolling the border is not an easy thing to do. And um, we are looking at other areas of improvement as well, not only infrastructure, but other welfare of, um, of our soldiers. For example, their kids. We have to make sure that they are well equipped, the proper footwear, the proper boots, the proper um, bergant, make sure that when they go on patrol, they are well kitted so that it makes their job a little bit easier and more comfortable. 